Before getting into the video, subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to get notified every time we upload a video. Now so far we have known a brief about Python, let us discover how to write code in Python. In order to write Python code, we need an editor. Unlike text editor, we cannot write Python code and run it on a text editor, so we require an IDLE. IDLE, which stands for Integrated Development and Learning Environment, comprises of Python shell and Python editor. While Python shell is an interactive interpreter, Python editor allows us to work in script mode. You can download the IDLE from the official website of Python, but for this tutorial, we will be using Anaconda. Anaconda is popular as it brings many of the tools which are used in data science and machine learning with just one install. So it's great for having short and simple setup. It uses concepts of creating environments so as to isolate different libraries and version. So to install Anaconda, go to Google Chrome, type Anaconda and then click on the official site. This will redirect to the site of Anaconda. Now click on pricing. So as you can see the individual edition is for free. Click on learn more. So here we are. Click on download button and it will take us here. So we need to choose according to the hardware compatibility. Check your system's property and accordingly select 64 or 32 bit. The downloading will take some time. The downloading is finally finished. Click open then click on next. I agree. Next. Keep the destination folder default. Then next, then click install. It will take more time. Just wait for it. Then once completed, click next, next and uncheck the checkbox and click finish. Now you can search for Anaconda in your system. Click on Anaconda Navigator and it's a success. Click OK and get started with it. For Python, we will be using Jupyter Notebook. As we click on Jupyter Notebook, we are directed to this page. We can create new python3 file just click new and python3 so this is our file and we can start with it let's say 6 multiplied by 3 press enter which gives 18 okay so that is how it will work now installation is done let us switch to more practical operations and application in the upcoming tutorials if you like this video hit the like button thank you